a very good morning Dutch bike blogger here walking handheld with a camera through a pile of bikes let's uh, change things here a bit because it's ridiculous that you cannot even pass here if you're in the stroller scoot mobile or walking with crutches or other impairment that you cannot walk easily it's a bit of a stretch to go uh, somewhere well going for a nice walk I have an appointment and instead of going by bike to the appointment I thought to myself let's go by foot don't do that too often although last time or a few videos back I walked from the Gedempte Zuider Diep to the Martini Kerk, Martini Toren. See card in the top right corner. A silent scooter, electric one. Just like that one, also electric. Nice way of getting around. I'd rather go by bike because, well, these scooters do cost money. I think 24 to 34 cents a minute. Which is quite an amount. The appointment is 11, so I really do have the time. I'm going to show you around a bit and go to the appointment and then in part two go back home. This thing on, yes it is. Normally when I have it on the chest I can look down and then I can see the light blinking that it's working. But now I do have the camera a little bit higher. Actually, now it's on eye level actually. Eye level will be 180 or so. 1.8 meters. I'd rather go on chest because that's easier to carry. Hope the stabilization does work a bit. Of course. Otherwise it will be a, a very crooked image. I actually cannot see what I'm filming because the back screen will go or switch off after 30 seconds. So I'm looking at a blank or a black screen. But I know where I'm pointing the camera, so should be okay. This was the Celeberstraat. There's the Sienskerk in the distance. It's built in 1934, so it's quite old. I did not tell you what day it is. It's uh, Thursday, November 10th, or 10th of November, 2022. And it's about... 16 minutes before 11 at the moment. Let's go down these stairs, have a look at the Flores Viver. This pond also was dug in the 19, 1930s, 1935 or something. Ah, somebody walking a dog, well, riding a dog. Oh, that sounded really bad. Uh, Getting the dog for a walk, let's, let's say that. Well, there are ducks and seagulls in there. Hi ducks and hi seagulls. Do you want on camera? It's gonna be famous ducks. Hello. Oh, they're speeding up because they think I have something to eat. Well, I ought to get them, but I don't. I don't, didn't bring anything for you. You have to be responsible for your own uh, lunch this morning. Don't fight each other, there's nothing to be fighting about. By the way, the ducks with the green heads are the males and the more camouflage one are the females. And there are more, a lot more. 
nice to see. Hi ducks. Nobody. Nope. Oh, there's another bird there too. Foot, we call it in, in Dutch. Oh, and there's a slow moving pigeon. Hello, pigeon. Well, welcome to the party. Where is no, uh, no party, no food. I'm sorry. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep. Hi there. <laughs> it's nice to have a look at the ducks. Let's go over on the the pavement again otherwise I will maybe step myself in dark shit and that is not what you want to do seagull pretty scared of course it will be taking off over running with his small red legs jump well nice that the family is following me let's have a walk around it uh, further on There I have the appointment and that building, so I have to go there in 15 minutes. Probably time enough to walk the block. Nicely carved chairs and probably glued together or cemented together with well, nicely, it's, it's loosened here. Well, and there's somebody in the chair forever. Looks like a, a dead person. It's actually a sort of statue on a beach chair with a person draped in there. It looks uh, very much for Halloween. Does he give us the bird? Sure, looks like. No, it doesn't. It shouldn't be. But it's, it's in the dark. You would be uh, pretty scared, I think. But it's, uh, well, somebody put lipstick on there. <laughs> How funny. Well, not really. Uh, oh, there's the family following me. Hello. Are you already there or all, all of them? Yes, they are. They're just following me around. Why you would do that? I don't know. Oh, please. Behave. Oh, somebody behind me, snuck up behind me, pigeon. Well, new apartment building, or new, fairly new. But all of this neighborhood, the houses I'm filming right now are pre-World War II, I think 1930s. Um, oh, this one is uh, for sale. 35% off. Well, that's a cheap, uh, cheap uh, rubbish bin. Let's have a look at the the watch again. Well, I ended up at the other side of the the pond, the Flores Vijver. And still, these creatures are following me around. Busy animals. That's a big one. The view over the, the pond. I had a video of this when people were ice skating. When it was uh, in February, it was freezing. There was all ice on this thing, and people were ice skating on it. See cart in the top right corner. Well, let's continue walking. Oh, that went a little bit too fast. But up the stairs. Go back this way. Here's the home of number 26 and 26A. In 26A there used to be a, back in World War II, there used to be a 
Jewish man living there, Leo Bohemen. And then New Year's Eve, the 31st of December 1943, he was shot by the Germans as a retaliation of a attack on a Dutch police officer, officer which was collaborating with the Germans. Let's walk over the grass. Oh, it's quite wet here. But let's walk there anyway. But he was shot as a uh, retaliation on an uh, attack of a Dutch policeman. Zilber Tanne. Not very nice, if you ask me. It was a Jewish man. He was married to a non-Jewish woman. That's why he actually survived that long and was not deported, but finally he met Faith. People shooting him. Terrible act. Well, getting onto the local street. Let's have a look here. Floresplein. Floresstraat. Domino's Pizza. Well, let's walk back into the park again. Let's have a look at the watch. I still have some time left. Back of the statue. And there's my feathered family again. Hello. How are we doing? There's a bigger bird in the distance there. Let's walk up to it. Looks like a goose, a Canadian goose. I think both of them, two. Let's have a look. One male, probably one female. Oh, they also have crows here. And a lonely bird with a white head. Let's have a look at these. Hello there. Oh, they're marked on their legs. What a beautiful bird. Stand still, please. I can film you. And this doesn't even look like a goose. I'm not sure what it is. Definitely not a goose. Please, I don't know. There's a funny bird with a very big paws. <laughs> really big feet. Let's have a look at the time. I still have the time enough. Let's walk up to you. Do some swimming, please. Oh, wiggle your tail. Oh, there the, the family again. Hello. the video thanks for watching please like the video subscribe to the channel check out the description box i will see you next time have a great day and like always be safe out there